I'm still like doing it a little. And I went down and just took the barrel, cut like this, right? And I did all with the black uh, finish ones, the blue. I actually just uh, took this ever so lightly to scratch off all the the bluing. I'm doing actually this again because it took me about a good hour working on this barrel. But um, what is bluing was like this. I took the sandpaper and really lightly and I did it up on these edges here. And I did it and just like this. I don't forget this was all blue. This was just like this down here. Okay. And I didn't do that part yet. I might eventually do it. Put it there. You can see there's a little still on there. I'm just going to kind of touch it up and show you how I did it. Okay. I did a little in there. Kind of like in here. And then just go on there. And then I really didn't do this. I'm actually doing this now. Um, and I went up in here, this part. Make sure you fold it up like that. Just get it up in there. You can go back and forth. Kind of. Yeah, right, that's how it goes. And then take it, fold this over, go down like that. When I go in one direction, this will happen, so you'll be getting lines in that. It'll be easier to polish it um, once you get all the. Um, okay, so, and you of course do the same thing with the barrel. Take it and just hold this like this. Back and forth. Get the front of the barrel like that. And you'll see. Round it out a little. And then all you have to do. It's your mother's making wheel polish. What I did, I put a little bit on there, like that. Just a little bit on there, like that. And I actually went over it like this. This will help. And I just did it there, too. Here I didn't really have to because I had already sanded this pretty much. And then you're going to want to take some of this again. You put just a little dab on your finger like that. It don't matter. And do uh, so the whole barrel like this. Okay, put something on the tip of that. I've already done it in here. Um, you see, I've already sanded that out in there. That's why and buffed it out a little. And then you just get any kind of old, old rag like this, right? And just go back and forth. Right. That, rub it. Same thing. Go on there. Rub it out real good. You'll see it will start shining because you want to buff it out to the way you're doing this. See the shine you start getting on that? And then take that like this. Now what I found it works pretty good. I'm gonna show you guys. This is sort of like a, a trick. A piece of typing paper. Okay, you can just rip the typing paper. And I found this really 
fold it over. And I found out that it really gets it shiny. Look at that. You want to see how nice it's going to look just using this. See that? How that barrel gets. And you rub it there. Take it, rub it there. And of course, what you can do while you're doing this, you can keep on uh, putting more polish on and doing this like this. And taking it and put a little more polish on. There's still a little bit of polish on here, but you can keep going like this to buff it out. You'll know, see it starts getting shinier and shinier. And you get a little bit more. Ever so much. I don't even have to put a lot, just a teeny bit on it. Okay, just okay. Get in there, get in there a little. I need to get the camera down a little so you can see better. And I, like I say, I worked on this quite a bit yesterday to get it to this state. In here, in here, and again, this. And you, you know, if you work, the more you work on the barrel, the more polished it's going to get. And you can see the stuff comes off. It really gets pretty shiny. And just do this again. Get, more. Get, more. Get another piece of paper if you want. And just do it again. It really depends on how much you want to do it. And you can pretty much get that all kind of nice. Get this barrel looking pretty good. Okay. Yeah. Really get that get that shined up pretty good. And like I say, all that was, I, it really wasn't this much work. I didn't really do a lot of work on this total. Probably about an hour of total work on this barrel. I just took it out to show you and then you can rub it in like this and just keep buffing every time you clean your gun you just take it out and buff it up a little and then you'll be surprised how fast it shines up it'll start looking really good look at that shine okay